a talent of his uncle, but he does have the drive, determination, and the knowledge that Junior shared with him. Lisa Lane went to the LA Rams training facility in Oxnard and spoke with Seau about his desire to carry on his uncle's legacy while also creating one of his own. I looked up to him. I wanted to be everything he was. So, you know, I try to follow in his footsteps and, you know, play on the football field with all that passion and something I try to live up to. Ian Seau strives to honor his uncle, the late Junior Seau, through football. While his size and stature might not match that of his uncle, his love of family, passion for the game, and determination to find success certainly does. This is definitely what I want to do. Whatever it takes, you know, whatever it takes, I'm, I'm going to find a way to make this team and this team or any team across the league. As one of 19 unsigned rookies on the Los Angeles Rams roster, making the 53-man squad will be difficult for the Oceanside native. But Ian says he's been able to reflect on the little things that helped Junior find success and 20 years of longevity in the league to motivate his own personal approach on the field. He always said, you know, your mind's stronger than your flesh, so just keep working, keep working. So there's not one thing that makes my uncle great. It's all the little things that he is that, that he's great at that makes him as, as great as he is. Another family secret to success, the ukulele. Uncle told me when I was going into college, hey, make sure you get a ukulele because when you're being uh, stressed, the football with school and all that stuff, you know, it really calms your nerves. And that's one thing that he told me he picked up when he was in the league. So, you know, I, hey, man, if you did, I'm going to do it just because, you know, you're successful and it'll chill me out. While Ian continues to honor his uncle through football, he says he also hopes to create his own mark and his own legacy in the league. Just show these people that I belong. You know, a lot of times uh, people get confused with the fact that you know, I'm content being just being here. You know, my uncle's last name got me here, but I want to show these people, you know, everybody across the league that you know, I mean to say I can play football and I, you know, I deserve to be up here on the stage. Do you play with any fear of the possibility of CT? Right now, I have too much fear of messing up on a play to worry then uh, about CTE. You know, that's kind of the last thing. And I look at the symptoms and, you know, once I feel like it's taking a toll on my body, that's when I know when to walk away. But as of right now, that is probably the last thing on my mind. And even though the Seau family firsthand experienced the downside of playing Playing football through the loss of Junior Seau. Ian says his family remains supportive and excited about the start of his own personal journey through the NFL. You know, they, they love it right now. They're excited to see what, what happens for me, hoping I make this team and hoping I could go out there, strap up on Sundays and make some plays so they could cheer me on. Reporting for Fox 5 Sports, I'm Lisa Lane. It would be cool to see him fall.